Hello, it's Bini here. Today, I want to talk about how you can install MetaTrader on your Mac. I know that this is common because you could use a Wine emulator and the MetaTrader that's compatible with your Mac will be provided by a broker. But a lot of brokers MetaTrader is not compatible with the latest Mac version and wants to work around here. Alright, it's a very simple solution and as you can see from this video, I'm actually using a Mac. Alright, so I have no problem running MT4 or MT5 on my Mac if I have this solution. So let's watch on. Alright, the workaround is not to use your broker's MT4, but to download the MetaTrader 4 or MetaTrader 5 Mac version from the MetaTrader website. Meaning that you go to the official source, all right, not to go for the broker source. All right, so first step, um, please download the MT4 or MT5, all right, it's the Mac compatible version, which is the one that's called the cross with the circle. So this is the Mac version, and then you install that on your Mac, all right. But you know, when you install this in your Mac, you are not going to have the broker server, all right. So we're gonna moved on to the next step to talk about how you can put the broker server inside so that let's say for example if you have an account with broker a all right then you can search for the broker server and you can use it on this version of the meta trader 4. now as a disclaimer most of the time that the official version from meta trader 4 or meta trader 5 it's able to work on your mac even on the latest mac os but sometimes when you have just updated or when apple just updated with the new OS, all right, the official versions can't catch up. So perhaps that you want to update your Mac OS just slightly a little bit later so that you can wait for the official version to catch up with the latest uh, version and to make it compatible. All right, now I have installed the latest Mac version. All right, to know that you are receiving connection for from your uh, current uh, broker uh, data source you need to check to the bottom right to see that there's numbers and the numbers is changing so this means that there's connection All right now my task is I wanted to um, set up this platform for my broker all right so the way to do it is go to the top left and click on the button that shows file and then click on this button which shows open an account all right so go to file open an account and it's just gonna come up with uh, this screen here Right, and uh, you can see I have different servers here. So depending on your broker server, so for example, if you like to uh, find a broker which is XE, all right. So the company name is XE Corp. Just have to key in XE Corp, all right, and then click scan. Okay, so you will scan through the different servers, even if you don't have that in in your uh, current um, you know trading servers. But once you key in XE, you can just search for that. You realize that I have different servers from XE coming up. All right, depending on which server you are located for your account, then you just choose let's say the relevant servers and then click next. All right, then key in under existing account, key in your login and your password. All right, so once we've done that and then you click finish, you should be able to get your um, account working with your broker in this particular MT4. Now check that at the bottom right, you are going to have your um, numbers here. These numbers means that there's data that's streaming inside. It shows your connection status. All right, so if it's not connected, you can just uh, rescan the servers and then be able to connect to your brokers. So it's just very, very simple steps that you can do, right? but that will get you uh, solved for your Mac issue. If you like this video, do subscribe to my channel and then give me a thumbs up and, uh, and look out for my next video that talks about trades.